So let's take a look at how to use update query on SQLite database table using Node.js. So make sure that you have this SQLite 3 NPM module installed. Type in NPM space installed space SQLite 3. After that, make sure to create one file. Let's say name it sample.js and this file is in the same directory to that of your SQLite database. In my case, game group is my SQLite database. Now inside which I have table with three columns, ID, name and email, and it has a bunch of rows, out of which I want to edit one row and change its name, okay? So next thing is to write our code, so write constant, SQLite equals require and then SQLite 3 module in Wobbles. Okay, so make sure to have it in Wobbles mode. Then call for new SQLite dot database. Okay. Make sure to open this database. In my case, it's game group DB. Make sure this path is dot slash if it is in the same directory. If it's in another directory, you have to type the word path. Depending on your operating system, it will be different. Next thing is to use your DB. Then next query is using run okay so you are running update query so update your table name groups and set let's say i want to edit one name as let's say it has one entry with name from here where id is six make sure to close this with single code because for query you need to have it in single code for your text make sure to use it in double code okay after that use function error and also you can capture this error Okay, and here you have to specifically use if error, then console.log error.message. Okay, then here console.log entry updated. Okay, this is if query succeeds. Make sure to close your run. Okay, now may show error because it is unexpected and you need to have to check this. So this needs to be removed and now it is properly closing. So db.close for closing the database connection with your SQLite database. So what we have done so far, we call for SQLite 3 module, then connected with our SQLite database, then using db.run, we are running our update query on row where ID is 6, changing its name, capturing any error, and output for entry updated. Okay, so open your command prompt or PowerShell, and node sample.js hit enter and it should return with entry updated message if it returns with error then most probably you have a few things here that are causing it make sure you have query in single quote and only in the text in double quote check whether you are capturing the function with this error properly okay 
So this was a short demo on how to use update query on your SQLite database table to change the data using Node.js.